kindly subscribe to our youtube channel see how to click on the subscribe button below and also click on the bell beside this this will notify you once we drop a new video thank you good evening everybody uh, i shouldn't have gone after osagi because now when i heard the news i cried for the first time in a very long time I know I'm not supposed to cry because I honestly believe that she's in a better place. I just, I wasn't ready to say goodbye to one of my favorite people on earth. It's true and she knew it. Because I said it pretty often. I said it to her. I said it whenever her name came up. Tosi Okno was unquestionably one of my favorite people on this earth. I really truly love that girl. Tosi with a Y not an I because she was one of a kind. Tosi loved Coke and Yoruba proverbs. She loved nice, MI, rooftop MCs, and me. Um, she was always so full of joy and so full of life. She was always so kind so, so kind to anyone and everyone that ever got a chance to know her. She had one of the most popular voices on radio, but it didn't matter if you were a new artist or an established one. If she thought your music was good, she would play it. And she would give you an interview and she never once charged a dime. Tosi Bokna was sweet, energetic, a ball of love, light, and life. A blessing to anyone who got to spend time with her. We didn't see her speak every day, but whenever we did, it was like we never missed a beat. We would catch up right from where we left off. But you know, one of my favorite things about her One of my favorite things about her, which I think is a lesson for all of us, is that it's not really about how or when you die. It's about what you choose to do with the life that you are given. It just seemed like Tosin did everything that she wanted to do. She'd have a radio show or a TV show one day and then she put, out her, she put out her own music as an artist called Contradiction the next. She'd do Jeans for Jeans one day, and then she'd do One Mic the next. She was a speaker and a writer, a wife, a sister, a daughter, and a friend, an OAP and a humanitarian, a deep soul, but more importantly, a kind woman. So I'm heartbroken tonight because I lost one of my favorite people on earth. But I'm so grateful to God that I got to know her at all. Tosi has taught us that we have to try to pursue our dreams and make the very best use of the life that you're given. So that is a reminder that when God decides he wants us closer to himself, the goal is that we would have done everything that we wanted to do while we were. Don't waste another moment not pursuing your dreams. We all pray to live long, but I think it's just as important that we pray to die empty. Just like Tosin did. I miss her, and I will never forget her. If heaven happens to have a radio station, I'm sure she already has a job. One of my favorite people on earth is now one of my favorite people in heaven. Rest in peace to God bless you. And one thing about her that I even saw in my dream was she was laughing and she looked so young and like a baby and she was just laughing and giggling and she winked at me and I just knew that was God's way of saying, Nikki, she's safe with me. Tosin, we love you so much and we'll miss you always. God bless you.